Hey everybody, welcome back to the Wolf Pit with another episode of What Are We Eating? Today, we're trying Devour's All Day Breakfast Steak and Eggs with Cream Gravy. I love steak, I love eggs, and gravy runs through my veins. So this sounds like my kind of breakfast. This 9 ounce meal costs $3.89 and serves one. The age old question, what do you want to eat? Whether it's breakfast or dinner. There's one answer that never fails. Steak. Well, Devourer has raised the stakes in their steak and eggs with cream gravy. Well, wait a minute there. They said steak twice and spelled it two totally different ways. I don't understand. Mixing juicy strips of beef together with perfectly seasoned potatoes, fluffy scrambled eggs, and roasted red onions, this decadent dish doesn't stop there. It smothers all that hearty deliciousness with creamy black pepper gravy crispy bacon, and shredded cheddar cheese for a mouth-watering meal that's ready to indulge whenever your hankering hits. Here's the list of ingredients, and Devourer calls it steak and eggs and creamy gravy. However, the beef in this is not steak, it's Angus beef pot roast. Pot roast is tasty too, but don't call the beef steak when it's actually pot roast. That's misleading the customer. The whole frozen all day breakfast contains 380 calories, 21 grams of total fat, 10 grams of saturated fat, no trans fat, 155 milligrams of cholesterol, 980 milligrams of sodium, 29 grams of carbohydrates, 3 grams of fiber, 7 grams of sugars, and 21 grams of protein. The ingredients say the scrambled eggs are made with whole eggs, which one whole egg has 186 milligrams of cholesterol. And the ingredients say the whole meal contains 155 milligrams of cholesterol, which is less cholesterol in this whole meal than there is in one egg. So how are you going to get filled up and call this an all-day breakfast when it doesn't even contain a whole egg? Does that make sense? Because I are smart. Here's the heating instructions and you can only heat it in the microwave. So let's get it out of the box and see what it looks like and get it into the microwave. Here's what it looks like straight out of the freezer. And now here it is after cooking according to the instructions. And it looked and smelled okay to me. So we gave it a good mix and then tried a piece of the steak or pot roast first. And that's a pretty big piece of beef, whether it's a steak or pot roast. So into the old pie hole and down the gullet it went. And Devour shouldn't even have called this steak and eggs because it tastes just like pot roast, which it is, and it's pretty good. It's a big piece of beef and it has good flavor and it's very tender. It was good enough that I had to go in real quick to get a second piece. And it was as tasty and tender as the first piece. And then we shanked a couple pieces of potato. The potatoes had great flavor from the mixture around it, but they were more like mashed potatoes than they were fried potatoes. And then I saw what I thought was a piece of skin of potato, but it was their applewood smoked bacon. As you can see, they were very stingy with the bacon. And the bacon was good as I expected. Bacon is always good. And then we went in for a bite of everything. The beef the bacon, the eggs, and the pepper gravy. Everything together tasted great. The dish as a whole had great flavor, but they should not call this an all day breakfast with steak, potatoes, and pepper gravy. They should just call this loaded mashed potatoes because that's what it is. On the last bite, when I took a bite of everything together, I got a little piece of the beef, which was the last piece of beef in the dish. So we basically got two and a half pieces of beef in the whole all day breakfast. This is more of a side dish loaded mashed potatoes than it is all day breakfast. This might be a good light breakfast, but you need a more substantial breakfast to get you through all day. This dish tasted good, but I certainly wouldn't call it a meal, especially an all day breakfast. I wouldn't buy this again, and I recommend you, the people, not buy it either. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you soon.